This video will cover exporting an exploded view to a PDF. Libre Design allows you to publish from all of the available workspaces. You can give the PDF to anyone with a recent version of a PDF viewer and allow them to zoom, pan, and rotate. They do not need to have a Libre Design. There are two levels of PDF publishing model only and full. Contact sales for upgrade options. The following suggestions can improve the quality of your published PDF. Before beginning the publishing process, make sure your workspace window is maximized. The Design Explorer can be toggled to invisible. Choose a white background for your work area. Make the exploded view fill as much of the work area as possible. To create a PDF of an assembly in an exploded view, you must have a license for full publishing, and you must be viewing an assembly in the exploded state. From the Libre Gem, select Publish to PDF. Select Continue PDF if you wish to append material to an existing PDF. The PDF Publishing Wizard opens, and the 3D Model tab is active. Select a template to use, and then click Next. If you choose one of the templates that includes exploded view steps, in Publish State, choose to publish in exploded or unexploded state. This will determine which state the model is displayed in in the PDF. Check the Include Explosion Steps and Descriptions box if you would like to include the steps in the PDF. Click the Font button if you would like to change the font of the exploded view steps in the PDF. The text PDF Publishing will update to reflect the new font. Click Next. If you want to add a header, select the Title tab and enter a title. Click the Font button to change the font of the title. Note, the title can be one line only and the text will not wrap. If you want to add a footer, select the Footer tab and enter a footer. Click the Font button to change the font of the footer. Note, the footer, like the header, can be one line only and the text will not wrap. Click Next. Check the views you want to include in your PDF, if any. The default view, the state the model was in at the time you began the publishing process, is always included. Click Next. In the Page Layout section, select the page layout you wish to publish to. If you would like to add a logo to the PDF document, check Put My Logo in the top right corner to include an image in the PDF, then click Browse to find and select the image. In Save Location, browse to the location where you want to save the PDF. It's a good idea to click the Preview button to see what the PDF document will look like before selecting Publish. This way, if you see something you'd like to change in the PDF settings, you can use the Back button to go to the item to be changed and make the change before publishing. Once you click either the Preview or Publish button, the PDF document will appear on screen. Click on the image to activate the document. Notice all the steps listed down the page and continuing onto more pages if needed. Clicking on one of these steps will cause the animation of that step, along with the steps leading up to the selected step. Clicking on Explode will automatically run through all of the steps in sequence. Implode will reverse the explode animation. Reset returns everything to the starting state. Note, if you choose to save to an existing file, after clicking Publish, you will be prompted to choose if you want to overwrite the existing file or add the published page to the existing file at the end as an additional page. This video covered exporting an exploded view to a PDF. Libre Design supports publishing parts, sheet metal, assemblies, drawings, and bills of material to PDF format.